Sorry about the background noise. Uh, I actually have the heat on on the boat. As you can see out there, there is snow. Uh, but it's actually pretty warm today, so I'm going to get a few projects done. Uh, right now, I just want to put a new zinc in. So I'm going to start that. So here's my new zinc. It's uh, aluminum. It's not actually zinc. Uh, apparently, this is more environmentally friendly. So they're pretty simple to put on. Uh, you just need an Allen key and a hammer. And you want to make sure that the shaft is clean. So, so found an Allen key uh, for this zinc. It's an uh, eighth of an inch Allen key. Uh, this prop shaft is one inch, so got a one inch zinc. So what I'm doing here is uh, undoing the the two Allen screws so I can get this around the shaft. Notice there's a little white washer there that helps to keep the screw from falling out. You can actually kind of see it there as well. So I'm rotating the shaft just to find, make sure I have a clean area to make sure there's full contact. I want to do this kind of evenly, so I'm just, right now, since it's pretty loose, I'm just rotating it a little by hand. Okay, they are now somewhat even. And yes, the transmission's in neutral. Okay, so that's pretty tight by hand. Now, this is what I was told to do. And this is why we have the hammer. So I was told um, you tighten it up as much as you can by hand, pretty evenly, and then you tap it on both sides to seat it. So now, these are a little loose again, so I can tighten them some more. And it's amazing how much more you can turn them after the tapping. I don't know if, if you have a diver come and do this, if they can actually tap it pretty well when it's underwater. So I'm just going to do it a little more. And believe it or not, they're loose again.
All right, one more tap. A little loose, but not too bad. This one's pretty tight. And that's it. That's how you put a zinc on.